Bill Wilson here from the new Lehigh Defense Plant in Northeast Texas. One day I was reading a gun magazine. They reprinted an old article interviewing Joyce Hornaday, the original founder of Hornaday Manufacturing. The interview was done back when it was just a bullet company. And the interviewer asked Joyce Hornaday, said, what made you want to get into the bullet business? And Joyce says, well, would you rather be selling dogs or dog food? That stuck with me and I couldn't, you know, sometimes you get something in your head, you just you can't shake it, you can't get it out of your head. I mean, for the next weeks and months, it's like, why, why not be in a business where after they use the product once, they have to buy another one. I, I said, well, I'm gonna get into bullet business. An opportunity come up to buy Lehigh Defense. And so here we are today. What we have here now is a brand new plant, Northeast Texas. All of our assets have moved into this one plant. And so it's all consolidated as a brand new Lehigh Defense. Building is, is 210 long by 80 wide, which I think that's 16,800 square feet, I believe. And machine wise, I think right now we got 20 machines in the building and we got one more coming down from Arkansas here in the, in the next week or so. We can literally design a bullet in the morning and test, make and test a variation and then a couple hours later tweak it and make another one and test it and test multiple variations of the same product all in one day. You know, for example, if a customer just said, okay, I need 20,000 of this bullet, you know, we can design something like that and make that pretty easily. You know, we're a big company that's doing cup and core bullets. They'll go through 20,000 bullets, maybe just getting the tooling all set up and everything getting ready to make bullets. 